Hi and welcome to my video series of small bio concepts explained in 3 minutes. It's not a detailed explanation but it has all the necessary information to save your ass before the day of your exam. So if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Now in this installment, we'll be talking about how NIC translation works. So NIC translation is a technique which uses DNA polymerase 1 to label a specific sequence of the DNA either fluorescently or radioactively. This technique, which is also known as head translation, was developed in 1977 by Rigby and Polberg. So NIC simply means giving a small cut and translation means movement. So NIC translation means movement of a cut? Yes, you are right. So the way NIC translation works is you have a DNA of interest where you put DNA polymerase 1 which creates a cut. Now DNA polymerase move from a 5' prime to 3' prime direction and as a result, if you give particular fluorescently level or radioactively level nucleotide, so a portion of that is going to be labeled by the radioactive or fluorescently labeled nucleotide. So what you can see that NIC that is produced has been translated to a different region and at the same time a portion of the DNA is labeled and that is how a radioactively labeled probe could be genera uh, uh, generated by the melting down the DNA further or a radioactively labeled probe could be generated which could be subsequently used in fluorescence in situ hybridization or in case of southern hybridization or applications like that. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, give it a quick thumbs up. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.